This is Dabu7 coming on the heels of a report that I just put out of massive landslides in Indonesia. We have a similar situation here in Colombia where more than 100 people have died, over 190 injured, and many more missing after landslides just come crashing through towns, wiping out homes and everything in them. Some describing this as a wall of water coming through the city. Now, in Indonesia, they had stated a half-mile section was ripped from the mountainside where the earth just gave way, and dozens are still missing there as the earth is still very loose in some of those sections, and the rains continue. Now, these heavy rains pop up in Colombia. Same thing, and it causes the rivers and the dams to just overfill and burst. Now, when looking back here this past year, there were several cities in the United States, around Houston and Texas, I think Baltimore was another, where heavy rain came down so quick that the, the areas could not handle it. Even around here, it was like that. But we're seeing these heavy rains come through and cause flash flooding and turn streets into rivers. I mean, Houston was flooded out severely. Like I said, other cities as well. And we know they have the technology here to do a lot of things. Look at HARP. HARP injects heat into the upper ionosphere and can heat things up. Now, imagine if you could do that to the eye of a hurricane or a storm system, you would fuel it. Now, we already know they can cloud seed. We already know they're laying chemtrails left and right. We know they have the technology. When was the last time we heard that they did something positive with it? Go ahead. I'll wait. Because it seems like it ain't never going to happen. Waiting on them to do something positive with this technology in terms of weather, I think it's crazy because it comes down to the hearts of men, and I think that a lot of these people at the top have bad intentions, or they're using this stuff for military purposes and other scientific stuff. And when they have something like this as a weapon, can you imagine? The countries could be completely not knowing that the storm systems that have hit them, the drought that they went through, has all been engineered by individuals that have been tinkering and doing things in the atmosphere and they just have no clue. And how are they ever going to prove it? Mm. One heck of a weapon, if that's the case. And it sucks that it's in the wrong hands at this point. Nonetheless, we're seeing some earth changes here. And I want to say this. These areas that have seen a warmer than average kind of temperature span are the areas that have been getting hit. And here for the United States, for much of it, they have stated that it's going to be above average throughout the first half of the summer, and especially for, for New England, upper New England, that whole area, New York City, Boston, they're saying that that's going to be the red area where it should be a scorcher. So with all that energy in the air, expect some big storm systems, big summer storms, spring storms. It's just kicking off. And that's some of the latest here from around the globe. I will leave a link and continue to update with more. If I see anything crazy happen, if you guys got anything you want me to report on, let me know, dabu7yahoo.com. Make sure you're following me on Twitter for the latest updates and also following me on my other channel, Dabu777. And I hope you guys are seeing my videos. There's so much censorship going on right now that all I can tell folks to do is to make sure that you're not in restriction mode, if you're not getting my notifications, seeing my videos, and to click on the gear box next to where it says subscribe, and check that you want to get email notifications for every single video that I post, or else they're just not going to let you know. I'm hearing it left and right, and a shout out, a thank you to everyone out there that shares the videos. It's appreciated more than you know. It's helping to fight the fight. Make sure to tune into the live stream on 777 as well. Much love, y'all.